What's up guys and welcome back to our Japan save in the Who's Local Tool of the Mod in DW 2016 We're at our first show, our first episode of our TV show which we have just called JAPAN Which I, I think it was quite aggressive enough but I, I want to pick, I want you to picture the opening credit as just a guy really aggressively yelling the word JAPAN at you Like uncomfortably aggressively <laughs> As you can see, as you probably notice, we've got some new folk in as well. We've got brawn worsts and a whole bunch of lads. <laughs> they call themselves the lads. Anyway, we have an incident with Suzuki and Ishii. I hope they've bonded over, like, uh, I'm going to say Swedish cinema. Possibly pigeons. No, that's not what I was hoping it would be at all. <laughs> I don't know. I think, I don't know if Ishii could take Suzuki in a fight. Probably. Uh, slap on the wrist. <laughs> I'm not punching Suzuki, he's too cool. I wish you meddle. Let's try and make some friends. I think AJ Styles needs to become friends with someone. I feel like AJ Styles would be friends with probably someone cool. That I like, I don't know, if Tommy ends, let's just try Tommy ends and see what happens. Oh well. So our first episode of our first show, so we're going to book the first match in a tag team title tournament. Oh yeah, we also brought on Doc Gallows. That was one of the other ones. So we've got Gallows and Anderson versus Ten Koji is our one of our first round matches. That'll be probably about eleven minutes. And Carl Anderson is gonna pin Tenzan. And our other match, uh, do I want to do those other matches? I'm not sure if I want to do it. I could do a final. I could do a, a four-way tag for the tournament final. Yeah, that would be fun. I might do that. So I'll have one match each week. We're also going to have. Oh yeah, we added another title, so we've got our heavyweight titles. Uh, which are here, which are the lovely uh, All Japan All Asia tag titles, I believe, and we also have the Japan Gajin title, Boo, Evil Gajin, Go Home, etc. Which I just used like a nice US title for that. We're gonna crown it in the most evil Gajin way possible by having a 20 man battle royal. So this is the fun part now, where I have to work out who does and doesn't classify as a foreigner, basically. Okay, I think I know who I want to want to have win it. So we're just going to add some people in. Rocky Romero. I guess Claudio Hero and Jericho. From the Carper. Oh, it's closed boot. Pin Walter, pin Tyler Black, pin. Oh, we have Drew now as well. Do I AJ Styles in there? Not really. Uh, Steen, the Sombra, I guess. Uh, Penta, Gray, Ricochet. On the end, Kendrick, Prince Finn, Trent. Is this for space for three people? Finley, Bray Phoenix, Nippon Korobushi, <laughs> and El Generico. There we go. No, not the World Grand Prix. That'll take up a decent chunk of the show, I think, probably about 15 minutes. Winner, it's gonna be my boy Tommy End. Runner up, I think we'll go Brody Lee, and we'll give him the most nominations. And then finalists, probably Steen and Penta, maybe? Good Penta. 
There we go. Our main event of our first show. Let's have Yuzuka lose to Okada. Put the title on the line. Why not? I know it won't. We're still at that interesting point where everyone's not quite where they should be in terms of popularity and the like. So that's when we need to start, you know, starting out as who our big names are going to be and who's not going to be a big name. Speaking of which, uh, oh my god, Naito's all the way to. Wow, Naito's far, 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 far too low down. Matt Cross did kind of bad in that match he was in, I remember. So we'll have Naito beat him. Story missing. We need at least one storytelling match. Let's just make this match storytelling, I think. And that's all we need to run our show. So I think, I think we should just run our show from this and see how we get on. So let's see. Oh, wait, where are we holding this? In the Shiba Shinkiba first ring. Which was 290 people. Nice. 290 people here to watch. All these stars. It's kind of sad. A decent match. Anderson and Gallows defeated Tenkoji in 1045 when Anderson defeated Tenzan by pinfall of the Magic Killer. So they advanced to the final of the tag tournament. And a decent match. Naito defeated Matt Cross in 1010 by pinfall with the Destin Destino. Excuse me. I got a 53. Then in a decent match, Tommy End won the Battle Royal, gets 67, Tommy End wins the Evil Gajan title, boo, go home, but not really, boo. And then a decent match, Okada defeats Iazuka, 15.03 by pinfall with the Rainmaker, nice. Increased our popularity in one region, nice. <laughs> so, we're slowly, you know, it's going to take a while before we actually build up to anything really significant but you know we're we're in the right direction to begin with let's see what will happen when this when this finishes loading in the meantime look at this picture oh. <laughs> okay, whenever i go to comment on what's on the loading screen is when it finishes processing i see uh brian danielson's gone to aloha uh zuka needs time to heal We've got less than a point one Oh, El Generico talks well. Give him promo timing. Crowds will respond, says Jericho. Hmm. I'm very suspicious of that. Think about it. El Generico, Chris Jericho, probably the same person. I'll see you behind we're hiring Demo. <laughs> because he's great. Uh, is Demo an alter ego? No. I like Killian Dane, but I'm so used to calling him Demo. I'm just gonna call him Demo all the time, so I may as well just call him Demo. Oh yeah, he needs to be heavyweight, obviously. Let's have a look at who our main eventers currently are. Still Izuka, weirdly. No idea, like. Let's scroll down to we find Tommy Ed. So Tommy had won a battle royal against tons of people. So you think he would have gained some popularity, but he's gonna still be exactly where he was, wasn't he? Or is he gonna be up to mid Carter? No, he's gonna be exactly where he was. Hmm. This is gonna take a while. Luckily no one complains about losing to each other because they all know it's just kinda of potluck where they are on the roster. Yeah, this doesn't make Dave happy at least until I job him out the company way. I'm not, I like Chris Hero. Uh, but yeah, so our next show is in six days when we're back with Japan. So, Japan! Needs to be more aggressive. Well, I think I should schedule our next uh, thing. So, let's think if we're on week 
two. So two, three, four. Wait, so we, we had a sh we had our first qualifier in week two, week three, week four, week one. So we went week one again. So probably make it Saturday, week one of February. I'll use that Japan logo that we made because it's like it. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna just see which one of these I, I like. Hmm. One life's enough. Is kind of. Am I going insane? There. Perfect. So our last show was three hours. So I'm gonna make this two and a half, maybe. There, I quite like that. Am I going insane? So yeah. So I think that's everything for this episode. Don't think there's anything else I want to look at. None of the other companies have run shows yet because they're still hiring people. Let's have a look at uh, how the other companies are doing. TLF is currently the biggest company, having run no matches. So that's a good sign. Go look at how Dave's company's doing. Just want everyone to look at that. Well, he has a TV show, which is interesting. Does anyone else have them? A few people do. Curb Stomp has a TV show. Top Star doesn't have a photo, which is kind of worrying. So like, in okay, fact, where's like the world schedule? That's like a thing you can look at, isn't it? Or is that just in older games? Diary. All right, here we go. Our next show, our first, our first competitor show is uh today you know i might actually advance up to our next show because if you look there are a lot of events between our next show is wednesday so we've got all this to go through let's have a look and see what other shows are doing this doesn't take too long to process actually hey i'll be careful oh god no <laughs> Poor Mr. Anderson, that's my reaction whenever I see him, it's just God know why. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying Japan so far. I'm actually really enjoying playing this save. So that's fun for me. I like having saves that are fun. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'm quite looking forward to doing things like a rip off G1. Because, you know, I'm a Japanese company run by like a weeb, basically. <laughs> like, I pretty much decided that my my uh, guy's gimmick is that he is basically the ultimate weeaboo. I think that's, his, that's like the best gimmick. So here we go, the first non-show of ours features Shane Haste defeating Tyler Breeze in the main event. Interesting choice. An EC3. Oh, EC3! Winning a belt! Nice! Is that like their world tale? And they also made the team of Chad Gable and Trevor Lee. <laughs> cool! Oh no! Uh, yeah. Oh, what's this? Oh, this is all the companies that I imported. Oh yeah. Hey, Mike Wackenbush! Good for you! Um, what was that? That was WPW. Uh, oh no, they're top stars, that guy. Now it's their mid-card title. I've got the big gold nationwide in the tag team. I might actually, as I go through this, I might actually see if I can set other companies' title belts. Like in the editor. So if a company calls it the big gold, I can just give them the big gold. I don't want a booking position, I already run my own company. Uh, let's see how long this takes. If it takes too long, if I think it's going to take too long, I'll probably just 
Uh, look at it. I actually found I could do that easily, could I? Because of the way it works. It's not an easy way to see how other folk have been running their shows. So yeah, I hopefully can start building up a bit of a better main event, hopefully. If I say hopefully enough it'll happen. Uh, whoop. Decisions. Oh yes, we've got Pock. Nice. He's gonna be King of the Cruiser Race Pock, like. But I'm just gonna rename him to Neville. Just for I've gotten used to calling him Neville. Is there a picture of Angry Beard Neville in here? No. Let's say I'll get a picture of Angry, Angry, Angry Neville, which is the best Neville. And. Just angry. Is there angry? Is the gimmick? Just really angry. Um. Maybe franchise player? That could work. Hit all fish. There we go. Yeah, I think we'll be able to get for all these shows and see how our company, our rivals are doing in that. That should be fun anyway. Might just do it for this episode and then I'll see. I'll see because this is like now added like about seven minutes on to the end of the video. In fact, I'll probably just stop uh, today and then come back next episode when we're at our show. And I might just occasionally check in on the other companies so we can laugh at them. Can laugh at Dave hiring Vince Russo as his booker and he'll probably go out of business. God, I hate this really loud chair. It's like whenever you move, it's like slowly falling apart. And I know it's going to fall apart. You're just going to like, we're just going to be talking in the middle of the video and all you're going to hear is like a loud bang and then just silence. But I'll still upload it for some reason. <laughs> oh, let's see what happened to SSA Shockwave. Oh, look at all these people I haven't heard of. Oh, they are female, I've heard of her. Anyway, yeah, I think I'll call an end to this episode here, because uh, it's been going on long enough. So, if you enjoyed this episode, leave a like. If you want to see other stuff I do, subscribe. Hey, if you want to leave a comment and be like, yo, check out my company, it's called... Butts. <laughs> First of all, great company name. Uh, second of all, uh... Uh, don't lie, because uh, I would have called a company but if I was allowed, probably. So I went for the Japan Alliance of Power Ninjas, because that was cool. Day. I just I really wanted the acronym to spell Japan, so I went for the corniest acronym I could think of, and it worked quite well. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this episode. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.